Rigging Station, presented by Diamond Fishing Products, makers of the finest monofilament and braided fishing line in the world. For novice anglers, the bimini twist might seem a bit intimidating, but it's really a simple knot and, and a special knot that everyone needs to know how to tie. And we're gonna start here. Today we're fishing with 20 pound high-vis monofilament line. Uh, with this kind of line and this particular diameter, we're gonna use about 20 wraps on the bimini. And if you were using, let's say, a, a thinner diameter braided line, you might use upwards of 40 wraps. So it's, it's highly dependent, but anywhere, any monofilament 20 to, let's say, 80 pound, you can get away with 20 wraps. So we're gonna start wrapping our line here. And we're gonna wanna keep tension on this the whole time. So I'm gonna put this underneath my feet. I'm gonna make sure I have enough tag line to work with. And then I like to moisten the line a little bit just so I don't get any memory. And as I apply tension and separate these legs, I'm gonna, I'm gonna decrease the tension on the tag line of my hand and it's gonna allow the line to just loop right down on top of itself. So here we go, I'm gonna start letting tension off of my, my hand on my right and I'm gonna be going down like that. Now you gotta hold it tight right there because if I let go with my left hand, that line's gonna unravel. So what I'm doing is I'm making one half hitch knot over a single leg of the line. So there you go. Now we're pretty much tightened up. What I'm gonna do to further tighten this, lock it down, I'm gonna do a, a double, one half hitch over the double line. And now we're gonna do that twice more. So one more half hitch over both legs. There's one. There's two. And then the final lock, I'm gonna do three half hitches through the same opening over both legs. There's three, and you're gonna to wanna to go slow to make sure the lines don't jump over each other. Give this a nice snug pull, and that's about it. I'm gonna trim this nice and tight to the knot because I'm not gonna worry about that slipping at all. And there you have it. You got a double line, nice clean bimini, and what's nice about this is not only does it give you a solid loop where you can attach a wind-on leader or a swivel, this knot retains 100% breaking strength when tied properly, so you're not worried about this being a weak link in your connection. So now that you know how to tie a bimini, you can go out there and pull in some big fish.